So when you're shopping for clothes, um, there's always that impulse that you want to buy everything that's really cool this season. You know, if it's polka dots or maybe it's stripes or it's a certain type of or cut of pants. Uh, but what you want to do is balance that in a way that A is affordable, because if you buy everything brand new every season, you're not going to be able to wear it next season. But also so you don't look like you're, you know, a fashion victim, for lack of a better word. You know, you don't want to look like you're walking around just wearing everything everyone has told you to wear. So a really easy way to avoid that is to mix your trendy pieces with classic pieces. Um, it's also a really budget-friendly way to fill your closet. So, you know, invest in certain pieces that you know will go with everything. One of those things would be a black blazer, a really well-fitted blazer that you can wear to work, that you can wear over you know, maybe a cocktail dress in the evenings, or if you even pair it with a really cool tank top and some big jewelry, you could wear it out at night. Um, another example of a classic piece is, you know, again, the, the pair of black pumps, you know, a quintessential must have for every closet and buy them with and buy a high quality pair because they'll last you longer and you'll see and feel the difference. So then when it comes to mixing the trendier pieces, try and stick to one or two trends. You can do different pieces, but never do multiple trends in an outfit. So, you know, let's say for summer, nautical stripes are super in. Wear a t-shirt or, or a boat neck sleeved shirt with stripes. You don't want to wear stripes on your shirt and on your shoes. And you don't want to wear stripes if you're also doing the sort of the Navajo print that's really popular. You know, that's that's one thing where you want to stick with one trend and then wrap the classics around it. And that way you're always going to look really modern, but you're never going to look, you know, out of place. And it's one it's a great thing for when you're looking back at photos of yourself because the last thing you want to do is look at a photo from 5 years ago and just think, "Oh my gosh, I can't believe I wore that." So again, it's all about taking the classic pieces that you can keep in your closet, and you really only need a handful, a bag, some shoes, a nice jacket, everyone needs a white button down, jeans that you feel really comfortable in, and then you can buy the trendy pieces around that. They can be the tank tops or the sweaters, and you know, maybe they're printed or patterned, or you know, maybe it's a scarf and in leopard print, because leopard's really popular. Um, that's where you can really mix and match, but it's important to have the basics down so that you always feel like you've got a nice classic look going on.